back in 1985, the last original Star Wars action figures. If you read the back of the card, it said you could collect all 92 figures. And here's a picture of that original back and card. But think if you could actually own all of these original figures. Well, here's a chance. Here's my collection. I don't... I've lost count of how many I have. But it looks to me like there is about 500. These are all originals. So, just looking at that 92 back list, you'll see that all the figures are numbered. And so I've actually sorted them on my table in this exact order. So if you can look at the uh, 92 back, you'll see where the figures should be placed to see how many of these I got. Now, unfortunately, as you may know, the Power of the Force figures are the rarest, and those are some of the only ones that are missing from the collection. Otherwise, from number 16 up to 92, I have every single one, and I have at least two, if not up to 16 of each individual figure. So two is the rarest one. And which ones did I see the rarest? We've got Wicket Warwick. There's only three. And there is the Black Bespin Security Guard. There's only two. And right beside him is 2-1-B. And there's only two of him as well. So out of that, that's the rarest ones I have out of all the main normal figures. Um, but as I've mentioned, there's lots, and I have at least ten. We've got stormtroopers, multiples, rebel soldiers. Look at all the Darth Vader's. Even this one is actually normally kind of rare. It's 8D8, but I've got about eight of them. And Solo Hoth Outfit. Got lots of those, lots of Chewbacca's, and luckily lots of Boba Fett's. Everybody likes Boba Fett. And I counted, we got 16 of the Imperial Stormtrooper in Hoth battle gear. I've even got some other great guys. I got the big monster from Hoth. And we've got the uh, Cantina or band at uh, Jabba's place. We've got a Jabba. We've got four Tauntauns. Or oh, I've even got two dogs from Battlestar Galactica. I just happened to get those. So they're just a bonus here. And what else? I've got a bag here I've collected. There's at least, I would say, about a hundred guns. These, again, are all original. I don't know if you can see them all in there or not. Anyway, just a bag just full of them. As you can imagine, with a collection of 500 figures that are all, you know, roughly 30 years old, the condition does vary. There's so many that are so nice actually look brand new but of course you have to expect that there's some that show general wear some of the black you'll see have worn off on helmets and stuff um, what else can I comment on here this is just an amazing collection as you know 92 figures were advertised but there was actually more than 92 because there was two different versions of C-3PO the later version you could actually take his legs and arms apart so I've got both versions, the original where he's all complete. And there was also two versions of R2-D2. Um, however, I think mine are all original. I don't know if I have any of the later one where there's a pop-up. Oh, well, maybe this one. Not sure. That's... Might be. So maybe I do. Uh, I have not played with these, so actually I guess I'm going to say yes, I do have uh, about three of them look like they have the pop-up. Plus there's this one, but I think this one's newer. I'm not even sure what this is. So, Ben, Ben Dara. So anyway, here's the rarest Power of the Force figures I have. We've got General Lando. We've got Luke in his poncho outfit. We've got three Anakin Skywalkers. We've got some of the rarer Ewoks. This is an amazing large collection. So here's a nice view of the whole thing. So these are all the original figures that came out between 1977 and 1985. About 500 of them.